There's so much happening, guys. I mean, a lot of people are being fearful, but should we really be fearful right now? Let us investigate further. Hello, everyone. Hopefully, you guys are having amazing XRPs around 51 cents or so, right? Just ranging, as we can see with Bitcoin as well. Look at this. The fear and greed index dropped below 50, guys. That's insane. So there's more people bearish than bullish at this point in time, right? So prepare for that. Just off the bat, guys, just now, basically, today, Justin, European Central Bank, asks some lenders to monitor social media for early signs of bank runs. You can't make this stuff up, guys. From Reuters, right? Early signs of bank runs. What did we talk about, guys? Does this seem very familiar, right, to what, to what happened last year, possibly? And then the Fed came in, souped in and saved the day, guys, for more banks collapsing, right, more contagion issues. It would have been a repeat of 2020, to be honest, but um, more so with the banking system. But eyes wide open, right? Withdrawing all your money because you fear a banking system collapse or withdrawing all your money to bring on a banking system collapse, guys. I mean, people may as well, to be honest. I mean, do they even have the money, guys? Probably not, right? I mean, that itself is an early sign of a bank run, guys. Literally, them saying this, they know what's upcoming. More systems, I mean, more more banks will collapse, guys, in due time. Um, just so the full-blown system becomes more centralized, right? So the bigger banks eat up the smaller ones. Now, listen to this. Time will tell, right? European Central Banks. So... From one of the Riddlers, they stated that from all back ago, now guys are stuck on part of XRP in the XRP community. Now this is quite interesting. So it will begin in Europe, I've been told. Time will tell. Why? Insolvent banks everywhere, especially in Europe, guys. So when this activates or strikes, right? Interesting. The level, wow, an emergency level liquidity crisis occurs in Europe. You didn't say United States of America. Maybe there will be contagion issues, guys, right? But specifically in Europe, mm-hmm, and you need some type of solution, guys. Fascinating, right? How do we know the system will fall? It's guaranteed. Well, Jim, Jim Cramer from a year ago, when banks were collapsing and whatnot, um, stated that JP Morgan is a fortress, right? And back then, he was a contraindicator. So right now, he's not so uh, not as much, guys, but back then, he stated this, okay? And the timestamp was, is, is this right here, guys, right, 58, but it's actually 13. 113, JP Morgan might literally fall, guys, right? The attackers may come in into the fortress, um, which is an emergency code, 113, right? 311 is 911. Um, so, but the real question is, are these bigger banks, right? The, the, human, the humongous one, guys, the top the top banks in America. Are they really going to fall? Um, maybe not, guys. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know about the top tier banks because a lot of billionaires have their assets in, have their fiat capital into these banks, right? Um, as well as all the people, all the American people have their life savings and whatnot, guys, into, uh, deployed into these banks, right? So even if, if they do fall, they're going to be saved somehow. Um, but pro will they fall? I know, I know for a fact the smaller ones will a thousand percent, guys. No, for Fifi, remember that nothing happens until something moves. XRP moves when major banks collapse. They'll need the bailout, guys. The reset will happen after the United States tenure uh, spikes 20 plus points in a single day. That's the key, so don't expect anything until then. XRP penny stock deception, then boom, guys. So, here's the game plan. We need to watch out for the debt, guys, right? The debt market, the implosion of it. That's only when the system collapses, right? And when you want, you can look at that chart, guys, right? The US 10 year. When it starts, this is what Gregory Manorino stated. When it starts moving up like this, guys, right? When it starts going up like that, that's when you know the collapse is here, right? Um. But the real question is, are we going to first have a mini moon to ten to the ten dollar range and whatnot? Here's the here's the game plan, okay? The Riddlers always say that XRP will be stable, guys. It will be like this. This is what the Riddlers have stated from the beginning of time, right? And the Riddlers have stated that XRP will have a moon date 
or or, or it will it'll spike up in a single night okay or a single day whatever guys um like a lightning bolt right so um if we have those right the clues are right there basically xrp stays ranging say uh stable for until it goes like that guys right and it doesn't come back down now others have have come uh have have made their own uh, observations that xrp will pump to ten dollars right because of charts and all these sorts of facts but the riddlers didn't say that guys the riddlers stated it's going to go stable until one night it pumps so if you believe in the riddlers you believe in this type of scenario basically but if you believe in the technical analysis side of things then you believe in ten dollars guys right first and whatnot um what do i believe <laughs> both maybe right why not both guys but i don't know this is why the riddler stated actually we're going to say it right now i was going to say save it for the rest of uh, for the end of the video guys but i have to point this out right now this right here guys from big short he just tweeted out yesterday take a break from what you cannot control now this connects with your life right with um anything 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 so why be attached right there are things we cannot control guys and we could go back to this topic right here right xrp will moon when it moons guys because we have no control over it but you could ponder upon that statement into any other aspect uh of your life guys right basically so let us step back for a second and remain calm not financial advice not anything advice not life advice anyway guys not anything advice but Check this out from XRP Digital. We already knew this information. However, Basel three deadline for bank is uh, for banks is at the end of this month. Could that be, right? Oh, wait a moment. A lot of talks about JP Morgan, right? And we and we did talk about how it's it's probably going to bite the dust, but it's, it's definitely going to be safe somehow, some way, guys. Now, supposedly, this this is what um. Charlie Charlie Ward says says right here, guys. Check this out. Things are definitely happening. I have to be I have to be so careful what I say so that I don't get myself in trouble. But things that you can actually see it and feel it right now. Um, and the, the, at the end of this month, the end of January, the banks have to be Basel III compliant. If they're not, they close their doors. Now, if I'm right with my information and Bank of America and JP Morgan are not in a position to be Basel III compliant, that's two very, very big banks collapsing at the same time. Now, I'm led to believe they're already filing for bankruptcy for, and I'll use this carefully, their fiat business. I mean, is that really the case, guys? It doesn't seem so. Maybe, but Basel III, um, right here, guys. Basel III has no deadline 2024. It's mid-2025. What are you guys talking about? Right? So, so the deadline isn't this year, guys. It's 2025. And guess what? It's until July of 2025. You know why that's so insane to me? It's because of this of this right here, guys. Debt limit agreement sets up potential showdown for 2025. They're not going to raise it, are they? Which means what? The collapse. Right? And then, still, it's reasonable to assume that the next X date may occur in mid-2025. Aha, uh -huh. so we got the Basel three. Coming like this, guys, converging, right? That's Basel three, and then did that, that agreements, guys. One point in time. Fascinating, right? Fascinating. Hmm. Risk on a uh, risk of default, guys, in twenty twenty five. Interesting. What do we talk about? Will our timeline, will our prophecy become fulfilled? When I tweeted out from twenty twenty two. Well, look, guys, I don't know, but I guess we'll have to see why. Here's another confluence point. You can't make this stuff up. What is this from Mr. Man, XRP? Now, supposedly, from 2025 to 2028, there's something new on the horizon, guys. So, we are here to get wealthy. This S, th this S is about to get real. Make certain, make certain you're ahead of this next you guys know as they state right here guys that's insane they're literally saying whoa food water a means to protect yourself shelter gold silver and crypto that adheres to uh prudential framework outlined by the banking cartel uh you guys know so basically 
all right what's what's going on over here guys we have to investigate because i've never seen i've never seen this in my life so wow they literally have it all jotted down guys noted down right wow look at this guys the out whoa what is this look I'm, I'm i'm actually shocked i've never seen this guy so table of contents right preface a possible future in 2025 which year did they state no other year than 2025 so we got basel 3 deadline in, tw in mid 2025 the debt limit right in 2025 mid 2025 or so possible future in 2025 which tells us a scenario of this right here guys the thing begins so it begins right and look what they say little just read this guys look at this wow wow if you haven't watched my previous video yesterday upon this topic where, where they say that the next thing is going to be 20x worse than the 2020 guys uh the 2020 year then you definitely should watch that video and prepare not beneath your voice we then see here we go guys brace yourselves as the truth uh, prepares to service on you guys know look at this e links to the, the, the development of bitcoin and cbdc's ah you don't say guys bitcoin's time is coming bitcoin the world economy with bitcoin will get sacrificed at a downside guys if the red alerts are true that means they're going to pump xrp to triple quadruple digits when the sacrifice when the sacrifice when the sacrifice does take place right with a sacrificial ritual does occur guys and they're setting it up right here it seems as with bitcoin right um not only bitcoin but usdt as well why usdt as well gbtc grayscale uh bitcoin redemptions today equal is equivalent to 640 million dollars just as sun magically pulled 640 million dollars usdt from his uh, from thin air today guys probably nothing right so, so uh, it's all being propped up guys which is good we need tether actually at this point in time to prop up everything guys we should actually be we should actually be grateful now listen to this tether holds directly indirectly or as reserve repos collateral to over 72.5 billion dollars in united states treasuries okay and here comes jim rickers he knows what's upcoming guys and he talks about what the implosion imminent with what u.s treasury market ready it's all coming to a deadline guys it's all coming to this full-blown finale it seems as prepare not financial advice so ukraine's not getting any new money from anywhere right now and they're losing the war pretty badly so um so the question is how, so where should you get the money well maybe they can figure this out but but all of a sudden johnson and the white house uh, mike johnson white house say hey we got 300 billion dollars sitting right here in the banks let's just take it and spend it on ukraine if you do that Yes, you will destroy the U.S. Treasury market. That is the I described as the reddest not, of red wait, lines. Does he, is he not? Is he? Is he? Is he? Does he realize that? I, I don't think so. Maybe he. Maybe he will now. I mean, I've been talking about it. Others have been talking about it. Maybe somebody will tap on the shoulder and say, hey, "Mr. Speaker, you know, do you understand what you're doing here?" So there we go, guys. Right? Wow, this is insane. So so this is crazy because they know what they're doing, but they're going to do it on purpose to destroy the Nacy's treasury market, to destroy everything, and Tether is correlated with its guys. You know why that's so crazy? We we are profits, but we're not at the same time. We're not, we're not, we're not, we're not. We're only here to make profits, guys. Listen to this, though. Years ago, we stated that Tether will not just go implode. It will have to go down when the economy implodes, when we didn't know about this fact, right? And what's crazy is they could, two, they could they have two options, to implode Tether, to collapse tether or to make it more centralized as i'm saying they'll probably go with the implosion way just because to make everything collapse listen to this is Tether the stablecoin of the future? So one of the interesting things about Tether and USDC, USDC was rising in adoption, uh, but it's a regulated stablecoin in the United States. And so actually people internationally don't like that. That is a turnoff to them is that there's now a coin that- Exactly, guys. That's what the narrative they're going to use to kill Tether, literally. The United States government has a lot of oversight in. And so Tether has continued to see adoption go up. Uh, they are the 16th largest holder of U.S. Treasuries. At this point, they are an essential part of the American financial economy. Look at that, guys. An essential part of the Nacy's financial economy. So if the Nacy's goes down, rip and good luck. So what does that mean for Circle then as it looks? Not to mention, Mt. Gox is coming back with their repay to repay its creditors uh, in October by October 2024. 
Baby Shore City right here, guys, right? There isn't that many people, or the final two for today's video comes from the purple effect. I mean, there isn't that many people who hold XRP, right? I mean, how many walls do you have? 10? 5? Exactly. So there's probably hundreds of thousands of people that actually hold XRP. Will they make those people rich? David Schwartz said yes. That's a very small price to pay. Not for nature ways. Let's see what happens in the future. Not for nature ways. Not for nature ways, guys. But anyways, guys, so for this amazing. See you.